Hello, my children of the internet. There's been drama in the drag world. So, Violet Chachki has annoyed a lot of people in the new episode of Fashion Photo Review in regards to Raja's looks. Now, if y'all ain't seen, this is what she had to say about Raja's looks, and this is her to a boot. Oh, choices have been made, mama. I don't know. The more I look at it, the more I'm like, I don't know. Like, there's, she's so covered up, it's like a nun or something. It's reading me like an old man sock foot with a slipper. I want a belt here, like the way those gold ribbons that come down. I'm gonna boot it. Oh my God. I'm a little confused on. Is it supposed to like she has a tongue on her crotch? Rippling on the side there, some for some reason really bothers me. I don't know if a fascinator was like the right headgear for this. I'm gonna boot it. Unfortunately, I have to boot this. Okay, so as we can see, Viola booted both of Raj's looks, and a lot of the fans, including queens who are on the new All Stars season, are not happy. We're gonna go into some tweets and some comments and. Y'all are gonna let me know what you think below, but I definitely disagree. I think Raja's looks are purely fashion based with a deeper story with each look. So my opinion is, you know, different, but we all have opinions. We're entitled to them, but let's start with some of the YouTube comments. So here's one of the YouTube comments from Macho Movie Man. If Viola ever does an All Stars winner season, she's setting a dangerous standard for herself with this sort of thing. I agree. Another comment from Charlie Petrico says, Okay, now I want Viola in an all-star season just to see her put her money where her mouth is. Okay, so here's another comment from Mina F. Raj's look was unbelievable. One of the best looks in RuPaul's Drag Race history, in my opinion. Visually gorgeous, a sense of humor, fun gender-bending take on the royalty prompt, as well as amazing and accurate but still creative references to historical fashion. What are they on? I want to say, um, I love Got Mick, but Got Mick just kind of seems to be there to agree with Violet, if you know what I mean. But she actually did toot the look. So let's go into a couple of tweets real quick. Here's a comment from Monet Exchange. There's actually two comments. The first one says, Booting Sutan, aka Raja. That's where I draw the line. And they tweeted again, OMG, booted Raja twice. I'm shitting, peeing, vomiting hyperventilating and crying all of it everywhere all at once so here's a comment which i actually found funny from cinderman it says this is the this is my joker origin story with two pictures of raja with a boot and a boot here is an actual tweet from violet herself she wrote i booted your fave checks notes i will be doing it again now here is my thoughts on the entire situation. Nobody is perfect. Now some people are clothes, okay? Some people are icons, but nobody is perfect. And I definitely think we all have an opinion and we are allowed to voice our opinion. But at the same time, I can understand why people are gonna be bothered. You know, this is someone who really is a fashion icon. Raja does not go on that runway to give y'all, you know, the lip sync she's not there to give you a performance she's there to give you fashion she's there to give you a look and i thought she slayed it i thought her look was actually well thought i put it was well put together and it definitely made you think which i think is a huge part of fashion a huge part of looks is when you actually start thinking when you're seeing said fashion so for me i disagree but i also think you know violet is valid in their opinion but child everybody is getting mad everyone is like when you are on all stars we gonna drag the hell out of you miss violet so i'm gonna end it here y'all let me know your thoughts below also we hit 23,000 subs so thank you all so so much i truly appreciate you all and hit that like button and if you ain't subscribed subscribed or um sherry pie is gonna get you thank you bye